Let's learn how to run a search limited by dates. This is the Trove homepage at trove.nla.gov.au with its search bar. Select Advanced Search just underneath the categories and click your choice. Let's click Newspapers and Gazettes. Now we'll need to add a keyword in one of the top search boxes and let's run a search for the Snowy Mountain Scheme today in all of these words. Scroll down the page and you will see the date range. We are looking for primary sources from when the Snowy Mountain Scheme was underway and I know that construction began on the 17th of October 1949. We will put this date in. You can click through the calendar view to select a date or type in the date exactly. The opening date was the 21st of October 1972. We can also click on the top date range and go to the months, then years. Then click the green magnifying search button and there we go. We have found articles from our selected date range. You can see the green tags just here with your search terms. Now advanced search is unique to each Trove category. So while a simple search works across all the categories, when doing an advanced search, you will need to run a new search for each category you are interested in. We will do this now. After we have found these newspapers and gazette results within our selected date range, I also want to see books published about the Snowy Mountain Scheme at the time. When you now click on Books and Libraries, the keyword stays, but the date range disappears. You could go back to the home page and start again, but instead you can click Show Advanced Search. From here we can re-enter our dates. Because books have publication years rather than days and months like newspapers, we can search by full years. We will search 1949 to 1972. And there we go. Here are books published when construction was underway. That's how you run an advanced search on Trove. Go for it.